Okay. Um. Well, good morning, everybody. Um. I'm gonna try something totally different here. Um. This is just gonna be um talking about random stuff. This is just again. This is something I decided to totally on a whim. But with um. With having some um. Uh, random background music playing in the background. Or I should say random music playing in the background, excuse me. Um, but like I said, I just decided to do something like this totally on a whim. Um, and I don't, I don't really know, I don't really know how many people are going to be able to see this. Or see, slash, listen to this. Uh, for right now, I'll probably just upload this to Twitch. I would like to be, I would like to be able to upload this to YouTube as well, but... I'm guessing the very moment they uh, they hear this kind of music, it's immediately going to get flagged for copyright, which really pisses me off because uh, it occurred to me that uh, I had I had this set um, many years ago, but all of my videos are uh, Creative Commons videos, like they're not monetized. I have no intention of making any money off of them or anything like that, but yet. The assholes at YouTube are just gonna go ahead and pop ads all over them anyway, so this really curtails my options. I'd actually love to make more of uh, more videos that have, you know, just like you know, just background music, you know, nothing super loud or anything, but not being able to because I don't want YouTube sticking sticking ads ads for toothpaste or some shit like that in here, you know, where all I'm doing is just, you know, just talking about stuff and having Gregorian chants playing in the background, you know, not Beyonce's latest album that's being played before it's actually released or anything like that. You know, it just, you know, just obscure ass music that no one's ever heard of or that no one listens to. So, but the format for this, like I said, this is basically just a test video just to see how well this goes. Um, if it goes well enough, I might do more of these more often. But we'll we'll see. Um, uh, what else? What else should I talk about? Yeah, I got a um, random event that happened. Um, one of my um, one of my early early earliest stream vids, uh, Diablo three. I had some random troll go on there and told me that uh, Diablo 3 is a shit game and it's a laughing at me. And she's sitting here, she's sitting here giving me shit over a video that I made like four years ago. I don't, I don't even remember what I said back then. But you know, it, I've had this happen like once in a great while. Somebody will give me grief over some video that I made some odd years ago. You know, I mean, I mean, that. And I was, that was, you know, that was me back then. I mean, the me now is totally different. Oh, that, that's, to borrow, to borrow the words from Miles Davis, I'm not there anymore. Say, you know, they're, you know, they're, they're sitting here trolling me over old stuff. So, nevertheless, I did find it kind of annoying. You know, just some, random passerby right out of the blue telling me the game I play sucks. Like, oh, oh, hey, wonderful, do share your, oh, do share your enlightened opinion there, sir, or ma'am, or whoever it was. So. What? I saw, I saw a YouTube video which I thought was a complete waste, like the, the most iconic moments in EVO history. I'm not even sure why they, why they even bother making a video like that because you already know the uh, you already know like the top number one's gonna be the Daigo Perry, and I think number two is gonna be the I think that Justin Wong come back, um, Marvel vs. Capcom, one of the umpty zillion versions of those that they have. Uh, one of them he was like one guy it was like a tag battle. One guy he had one guy left down to a sliver of health. His opponent still had fresh hail and three fresh hail and hardy opponents. He managed to come back and kill, take out all three of them. 
with only slimmer health. I mean, so that that was probably like number two. You know, so I'm again, I don't even know why they bother making those kind of lists. I mean, because you already know at least two of those roster spots are already taken. Did I just say roster spots? Sorry, I just couldn't think of anything else to say. But, you know, maybe if they made a... If they made, like, a top... You know, may, if they, excuse me. Maybe if they made, like, a top eight. A top eight list, because we all know the two slots are going to be Daigo Perry and Justin Wong come back. So we, those are already locked in. Or make a top ten list. That's not the Daigo Perry and the Justin Wong come back, but... I got a feeling uh, most people probably won't even watch that one because I'm sure for a lot of the people in the community, it's only those two moments that matter. So. I'm starting to watch, um, I'm starting, starting to get into a, into a manga artist called Junji Ito. It's considered to be very dark, gross, and disturbing. Which, I mean, I've been working in retail for 30 years. Try me. So, but kind of like his stuff, the problem is, is, um, it's, it's either, I don't, when I'm at home, I don't, I don't really read books. I do them, um, I do my book reading at work. But, uh, the problem is, I tend to have a lot of, I tend to have prying eyes and ears and whatnot. Um, I don't need to be, um, we're all, we're all a bunch of goldfish crammed together in a small fish bowl. Um, I guess if, if it makes sense at all, it's kind of like crab fishing. I remember watching something like that when one, um, when one crab dies, it gives off some kind of odor or some kind of pheromone or something that causes all the other crabs in that same boat to suddenly start dying as well. Kind of the kind of the same thing here at my job. I don't need um. I don't need one person coming in, or that that's what it was. People at my job tend to be very gossip heavy. They like gossiping. So I don't I don't really need that one person coming in. So what you reading? Oh, I'm reading this book by Junji Ito. Um, yeah, it's about these corpses that this person likes to stitch together. Yeah, see here's a picture of it. Oh God, what is that? That's disgusting. And then. She'll go off and, like, tell everybody else at work what I'm into and all that, and pretty soon everybody starts treating me differently. I've had this happen numerous occasions. I say the wrong thing to the wrong person. All of a sudden, everybody just starts behaving around, behaving real funny around me. So, because of this, I have to be very selective with what I, with what I, with what I read at work. You know, and now it's, so what you reading, Joe? Rolling Stone magazine. Oh, okay. It just becomes a pain in the butt, and then the moment they walk off, switch out of Rolling Stone back into whatever it is I was reading or reading or watching. I have a I have a YouTube app on my tablet. To go back to whatever it is I'm I was previously reading that I didn't want anybody knowing about, because in no desire to become public enemy number one. Forgot what I was saying previously. Oh yeah, but anyway, but um, I've been uh, having to watch um, watch Junji Ito stories on YouTube now. They're very difficult to watch. I mean, it just I'd rather actually read it, but uh, I probably should look into it in the future. But again, I don't I don't really read books at home. I do most of my reading at work, so having to having to watch the books. It's very awkward and difficult. But that's, there's a conundrum I'm in. Oh, and um, I guess I should talk about the music I'm listening to, Gregorian Chants. Yes, I do enjoy listening to this kind of stuff. Um, but it, I'm not, I don't go to concerts or anything like that. I don't listen, I don't listen to this stuff 24 seven or anything like that. Um, it's just one of many genres of music I get into. Um, I listen to damn near anything except most country, most rap, and most pop music. 
They said they, they, they can keep that. Um, see, what else should I talk about? I could have sworn there was something else, there was something else I was wanting to speak about. I can't remember what it was. Oh well. Well, anyway, this is meant to be just a test video anyway, just to see how well it works. So I'll just go ahead and cut it off here. And then um do whatever editing that needs to be done and all that, and I'll try uploading it afterwards to both Twitch and YouTube. So, otherwise, thanks for watching, or, or listening, I should say.